Hi Leo's, welcome to your reading. Guys, hopefully y'all know the drill. <laughs> this reading is meant to give you confirmations of the things you already intuitively and instinctively know and sense about your person and your connection. If this one does not resonate for you, check out your other sign positions, your sun, moon, rising, or Venus. Sometimes in relationships and partnerships, the signs in your 7th and 8th house will resonate. And if you're having a love affair, the sign in your 5th house may be the one that will resonate for you. Let's jump in. Let's see if I can get you confirmation so you can get some kind of idea. Is this your reading? Are the messages meant for you or not? Let's get the connection, the energy going. First person. Ooh. And of course, it's going to hit the floor. Y'all bear with me. And y'all can hear me. I'm a little bit croaky today because of allergies. Allergy medicine just not kicking in. We've got a devil card on the first person's energy, guys. Devil card. Ooh, okay. So somebody is really fighting with those inner demons. Let's see what else. We've got Ace of Swords. Ooh, they feel confident they're going to overcome whatever that devil's representing. Sometimes devil can just represent toxic way of thinking, uh, behaving, toxicity in environment or lifestyle. You know, sometimes it's addiction, things like that. The person is feeling confident that, that they're going to um, change. Let's put it that way. Free yourself from whatever it is. Second person. Second person's energy. We've got a knight of pentacles. Somebody's moving slow. <laughs> slow. That's Virgo energy. But let's clarify what's going so slow that they are hopefully being practical. But they may not be because it's trying to go sideways. Mm, they're not enthused. They're not happy about uh, making changes. Mm. The Four Cups energy is uh, uh, opportunity, wanting to let an opportunity pass by because I'm just, I'm not happy about this. So, bottom of the deck, we've got rest, recuperation, and recovery. Recovery. Okay, so with this, it, it is sort of sinuating that someone in the connection, we may have had uh, how do I put it? I hate saying it like uh, a lifestyle, something, a habit that is considered not so good for us. Yeah, a little bit toxic. A uh, person over here has decided like, let's, let me just get real here. Let's use uh, alcohol, like alcohol sobriety. Uh, we may have had this in common with each other that we were off the wagon in the connection we're both indulging in in and somebody wants to you know the recovery sober up this person is like i don't want to <laughs> i don't want to that kind of thing so um and that that's going to cause some issues what's up under the four yeah, um, might be some um, struggling, harsh battle going on right now as far as words, feeling defeated, um, lashing out at each other uh, over the change. Mm -hmm. It's an opportunity, definite opportunity to uh, actually something change on a tangible level over here for this person. This person is a little for it. They know it's a good thing. But at the same time, it's emotionally overwhelming. Mm -hmm. Options, options. What happens if if we incorporate this new change coming in as far as what do we have in common then? Because this person over here, it would be insinuating this person is just not ready to sober up yet. Uh -huh. You see him, he's looking at the cup like, hmm, I don't think I want to give it up just yet. This person's uh, probably already gave it up. Mm -hmm. and it's caused some strife between us some emotional mental um unbalancing in the connection for us leos i hope that was enough for you to know is this your reading or not let's jump in let's see what deck they would like to put some energy on and mm, that was quick the person's ready to talk there's some another one hang on because i can still feel their energy 
moving around me. We're going to get two different decks. We'll go with it. Mm -hmm. Let's let them talk with this one first. This is for my Leos, their person. And y'all forgive me for the third thing. I know I'm struggling here. Because the sinuses are just like all banging. Mm. Allergy medicine is going to have to be changed. First thing out, I'm tired of being played. I'm tired of being played. It breaks my heart that we can't have more than we do now. Leo's, Leo's person. Mm. Baby, please don't treat me bad. I don't mean to take my frustrations or frustration out on you. Give me another chance to show you how much I love you. I distance myself because I don't want to be held accountable for your suffering. Ooh, guys, are we are we seeing this? Because, like I said, the one thing I do want to point out, if it's if this part resonated for you, the person is considering it. They are considering following the other person's lead of, yeah, let's put it down. Let's let's put the chalices down. What if you finally see? I'm not good enough for you. I'm sorry. You rejected me. It still hurts. I can't do this anymore. You could have any anyone... Why would you ever want someone like me? Hmm. Your friends don't like me. May, may add in family on that one. Because I heard family, friends, family. Leo's. I was fooling myself. I fell in love with the image of you that I had created. I didn't think you would ever give up. <laughs> or just... Quit. Ooh. My love for you and them has ripped me apart. That may be flipped energy of the friends and family is, is the love for them and the love for us ripping you apart. Mm -hmm. I need to be selfish right now and focus on learning to love myself again. I'm sorry I wasn't what you expected. I feel so much regret for the things I have done and said. Let's do a last shuffle on this deck. Mm. It's easier to stay away now than face the loss of you later. Let's go ahead and switch here. It's from Leo's. I've hit rock bottom. It's hard to cope with the terrible choices I have made. I'm waiting for the perfect opportunity. So many questions with no answers. I'm lonely for you only. Talking. There it goes. All that glitters isn't gold. You did try to warn me.
we need time to find ourselves. I wasn't ready to deal with it, much less face it. I feel like I'm running out of time. My pain matched. Your pain matched my pain. I don't want to be broken anymore. One more shuffle, guys. One more. Ride or die. I wish I could just forget all of this. When you close your eyes, I want to be the one you see. I feel like I have nothing to contribute to this relationship. Mm. Leo's, guys, I hope it was helpful. Y'all stay blessed.